Today is a very exciting day if you are, like me, a massive Kingdom Hearts fan. Oh man, I just kind of want to go into my love for Kingdom Hearts, my love for Donald Duck more than anything. I vaguely remember the PS2 game Kingdom Hearts and it was funny because I seen it on the shelf and I'm a Final Fantasy girl like through and through. However, I have had this massive obsession with Donald Duck. God, <laughs> when did that start? And it's still not over just yet. And I remember getting Kingdom Hearts on the PS2 only because of Donald Duck. So thank you. Thank you for that. And I had no idea the journey that I was about to go on. And I can't believe now, in my 30s, we're still out here messing about with Kingdom Hearts. And I am so excited for this, you guys. I remember on my channel going through all of the Kingdom Hearts games, all of them minus like mobile, because I just, I can't get into mobile gaming. It's, it's just not for me. And I had so much fun and I did that in the lead up to Kingdom Hearts 3 and I went to Germany for Gamescom and I got to play Kingdom Hearts 3 before everybody else and I was just like freaking out, oh my god. And yeah, I remember having a trending tweet as well when I found out, I don't even remember how I found this out, but I found out that Drake Bell was one of the voice actors and I had like a trending tweet because of that and then people stole it and that's how the internet goes and actually I think Drake Bell has turned out to be a dodger so maybe we won't <laughs> go into that too much but it's been a while to answer any questions to my Kingdom Hearts audience who watch me I played the melody game in my own time and it was so much fun you guys that game, it was so good. I didn't do it on YouTube because I didn't know if the copyright system was gonna be fine, like with the music and stuff like that. So I just played it in my own time and I watched the cutscene at the end of that game. And also the DLC, there's actually one fight that I haven't even put on YouTube yet. And um, I got to Hyortza and I attempted him a couple of times and I was like, I'm gonna need to actually sit down and properly try and take this guy out. And to this day, I still haven't. So maybe future stream, who knows? But it is the anniversary, the 20th anniversary for Kingdom Hearts. I feel very old now. Oh brother. And they've done it. They have announced Kingdom Hearts 4 and I'm ready for this. Um, I've heard from a couple of people. Graphically, apparently Sora looks very different. Like, I think it's just obviously when, you know, you update your graphics, then your faves will always look a bit different. But I'm excited to see you. I'm a Donald Duck. I'm so excited for that. So, with that being said, let's have a watch of Kingdom Hearts 4. And you are going to go over here. You'll just like see his feet in the reaction. Maybe not. <laughs> I'm ready for Dearly Beloved to make me cry. You know they're gonna play it, right? Oh! Yeah, like, Kyrie disappeared or something, didn't she, at the end of three? Oh! It's like Final Fantasy XV, what the hell? It's, it's not cartoony at all. Wow! Oh my god! Oh my god! He has feet! The regular sized feet. I'm getting chills right now. Woo, woo, woo. 
私たちにとっては死の世界ってことになるみたい Uh oh, that's not good. Now when the darkness comes for you. Oh my god! He's so beautiful! He's like one of the first bosses that you ever see in Kingdom Hearts. I'm so happy! Sora has regular size shoes. The Keyblade. Oh my God! Gameplay. I hope they took the attractions away, or at least dumbed them down a bit. Oh, oh. You gotta get Donald in this. Where's Donald? Dana. Ichido Taijo Seba. Moto no Sekai ni Modore. Organization, douche lord. No, I need more than that. Please. That's so. No, is that Vivi? Ah, fucking Vivi. Donald. Donald! Oh, Donald in Japanese is weird. Don't hurt Donald! Magic in the making? Ah, ah. Oh wait, that's it. Why is that it? I need more than that. I like I need more than that. I'm sorry. All this time I was like Donald and then I seen a mage and I thought it was Vivi. It's not Vivi. Although, yeah, we've had Vivi in Kingdom Hearts before. Oh my god, you guys, it's so freaking exciting. It's so exciting to me. Graphically, it's it's worlds apart from old school Kingdom Hearts. Interesting that it said, if you do leave this world behind, don't expect to return to the one from which you came. Obviously, you know that somehow Donald and Goofy are going to make their way back to Sora because we're the three amigos, duh. But it is actually... It's sometimes kind of amazing how they can keep the Kingdom Hearts games going on. I'm not complaining. I'm very happy about it. But the amount of times that I've been like, that's a good ending. And then it something happens like right at the end of it. Now, does this mean that we're in Yortza's world? Maybe that could be really exciting having those two like properly clash, not just DLC clash. God, I'm so happy. Uh, although, the other thing I wanted to say, right at the end, it showed um, Kingdom Hearts 3 logo. Yeah, like when it, it was like Kingdom Hearts and then 3. So... That's interesting. But obviously it's not a DLC. They have come out and said that Kingdom Hearts 4 is coming. I'm so excited, you guys. Um, of course, when Kingdom Hearts comes, it will be on my channel. I've made it quite clear how I have wanted to go back into the world of gaming. It's where I started. I took a little break and went into anime, but anime was never supposed to be the main thing. And you know what I'm like, I tend to like switch it up every so often and I'm desperately, desperately wanting to just play more games. That's, that's where my heart is. And when Kingdom Hearts 4 comes, that's where I will be, okay? That's where I will be. 
All right, I'm so excited. Let me know what you think about all of this news in the comment section of this video and I will catch you in the next one. Thank you for watching. Bye.